Roberto. I'm originally from Venezuela and I've been living four years in Chiang Mai. I'm the founder of Air Developer. We're a Chiang Mai startup that is focusing in creating innovative ways to fight against air pollution. We fight air pollution in a way that we can control it, you know. We do this by putting sensors in every different location, such as coffee shops, uh, gyms, co-working spaces, and massage shops. At the moment, uh, 22 places. We want to focus on that by providing affordable and effective ways to purify the air indoors, and then people can just use our app and find these places that have clean air around Chiang Mai. The very first one, because I want to include blockchain and crypto in my project, uh, I just went to the Bitcoin Meetup group. Uh -huh. um, I talked to the guy running the, the event, yeah. and he's also into air quality, and he liked the fact that I, I already was producing and making stuff. So he decided to join me. Now I, I, I produce my thing yeah. And, and yeah, I, I show them we managed to build something from nothing and yeah, it's going well. Oh, that started um, well, like 12 years ago or something uh, when I was in England. Um, there are not many Latin DJs, so yeah. I can go and play something and people enjoy it and can, can dance it. That's where I find my girlfriends. Ah, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Hello, I'm Dr. Suratan Pavet. Or my pupils call me assistant professor. Or you can call me nickname Tilu, which is actually a Chinese name. I'm the staff at the Faculty of Medicine, Chiang Mai University, and also uh, the founder of the startup called Smile Migraine Application. And I, I'm also doing like mentor of the, the young startup in the Suwannok Medical Innovation District as well. So here is the Chiba Care, which is the rehabilitation center. So the service for the patient who is suffering from uh, brain disease, for example, like Alzheimer's disease, migraine, chronic pain, and stroke. เออเอาก็ดูแลคนไข้ไมเกรนมาแล้วรู้สึกแบบทําไงดีวะแบบไม่รู้จะแก้ปัญหาก็อย่างนี้ยังไงอ่ะมันก็เลยจะต้องทํา
Hello, my name is Patricia. I am an innovation advisor and manager at Yellow. Yellow is an ecosystem of blockchain professionals, experts, and uh, enthusiasts. We have a blockchain incubator and co-working space here in Chiang Mai. I'm, I've been here for the last three years, and the reason why we chose Chiang Mai is because we believe it can be a great startup hub in Southeast Asia. Quality of living here is fantastic and at an affordable cost. So when you're starting your project and uh, it's very difficult to be in a place like Silicon Valley because it's very expensive, but here is like the great place to set up your startup because it has all the services and facilities, ultra fast internet, and really everything you need to, to start your company. And uh, we love the safety, we love the weather, we love the people, we love the nature around Chiang Mai. It's really, uh, we, we are very happy to be here. So mastermind is a term that is from the beginning of last century. It was, came from a book written by Napoleon Hill. He explained that to be uh, any businessman who wants to succeed should get the support of his colleagues and peers. And we decided we wanted to also organize one to support the community. We are at the Mai Am. So it's a contemporary museum of art in Chiang Mai. Now there is an exhibition by Thai artist, Dasanai. I feel very fortunate to finally see some of his art in Rio. Yeah, I absolutely love this part of the museum and I think the art here is, is so, so good. Thailand has some amazing artists which I really, really admire and it's mind-blowing what a big NFT community it has. There are so many artists doing so many great things, so yeah, I love uh, the art scene in Chiang Mai. And this is one of my favorite places, to come and spend the morning here and after go to the hot springs in Kantien, for me it's like the perfect place. My name is John Ho. I'm from Hong Kong. I came here five years ago, and I'm the owner of Alt Chiang Mai, the first designed and built co-living and co-working space in Chiang Mai. So I worked in hotels in Hong Kong for nine years, and that's a little bit in my DNA, right? And when I got here, I also uh, got connected with the digital nomad community and the whole remote work movement. Uh, because this is Chiang Mai and every digital nomad comes to Chiang Mai. There is a space that people can work and live together. We provide a platform that e people can just easily come in here and there's a community of people of similar background or who has the similar lifestyle and they can just easily plug into the system and, and the pace of life is healthier. Chiang Mai is not the most efficient. We know there are flaws, uh, but the pace is good, it's healthy, you know? You don't work too hard. So, you know, you have a good balance of life. Saturday, Sunday, naturally, I, I do family activities. So, potentially there's two and a half days that I can hang with my family. Because I was dating my girlfriend, now my wife. Yeah, she brought me here. So I was like, oh, Chiang Mai, interesting. The first impression, it's not like Bangkok. It's not like Phuket. And that's very diverse, super diverse here in Chiang Mai, right? So you have people from all nationalities, different background. But traveling is different from living. And here it's, uh, it's good for living. 